I've never been in a gang, but I can throw up a gang sign before, before I, I learn to, to speak. speak. Posing in family photographs, throwing, throwing up, up my street. As if our slanted fingers were trying to grasp an American dream just, just outside our reach. In high school economics, I sat next to Marcelino. We both showed up late, sat in back, slept, slept and cracked jokes. jokes. But from the first day of class, it, it was, was obvious that the teacher assumed one of you is going to college and the other is going to jail. The difference was as clear as, as the, the color, color of our skin. skin. My throat turned to stone the day I heard Marcelino got arrested. His older brother stabbed a man in the chest three times and cried out Nordeño to the air. Marcelino was sitting, sitting in, in the car. car. He had nothing to do with the murder, but I will graduate with my degree before, before he, he gets free of prison walls. I grew up in a Chicago tenement where me and my siblings had to be inside before the street lights came on or else my dad would kick our ass. My parents wanted to protect us from being the chalk outlines of dead bodies in the streets. The same year, ain't, ain't nothing, nothing but, but a gangsta party. party. Went platinum. I got jumped in by the popular kids in the bathroom of my, my white middle school. school. Smashed against the floor with blood, blood running, running down, down my, my shirt. shirt. I wondered when it became cool to, to pretend, pretend that, that we, we were gangsters. My cousins were walking with my father in the parking lot of a local liquor store when the rivals pulled up next to them and, and started, started shooting. shooting. My cousin got hit a couple of inches lower and he would have been dead, but he survived to this day. Still rest his set. We've seen the blood, but, but we've, we've never, never been, been the victim. victim. Never held a gun. This is not our life. In the past, past 20, 20 years, years, over 20,000 20, people have been murdered by gang violence. If, if those bodies had white faces, faces this, this would be front page news every single day. In a different lifetime, Marcelino could have been a senator. My cousin Yaved could have been a professional soccer player. There, there are future, future teachers, leaders, and, and prophets being lost daily on inner city streets. We have enough distance to know that, that there is no glory in this. In this. If I could, I would freeze time in the middle of a drive-by, the second before the first bullet is fired, and take the gun away in order to leave the image of a young man with his arm reaching out the window, looking like Adam on the ceiling of the Sistine Chapel, thinking about slash the touch the hand of God. We forget the women staying up all night waiting, waiting for their children to come home. We forget, forget the quiet acts of resistance against the system that is built on the backbones of mothers whose bodies break under the weight of caskets bearing sons killed fighting someone else's war.